I'm a Sentai Hyperion, and this is One Minute Halo. If you think tornadoes and hurricanes are bad, then you probably wouldn't want to get caught in a glassing event, which is the most common way the Covenant incited extinction events on planets in the Halo franchise. But how does shooting purple goo onto the ground result in a dead planet? Well, it goes something like this. Plasma contained within a magnetic bubble is fired down on a planet. Once the bubble strikes the surface, the magnetic field collapses, resulting in a massive release of energy in the form of heat and radiation. This intense heat spreads outwards, vaporizing pretty much anything in its way. If you somehow survive the disintegrating heat, you'll have to try to survive the nuclear winter brought on by the blast and the resulting ash, moisture, and debris that was forced upward into the atmosphere, blocking the sun. If by this point you're still alive, you'd have to navigate the evaporation of your planet's oceans. The Covenant would use these plasma lances to dry up any significant bodies of water on a world, and if your grade school science class taught you anything, is that not having a water cycle is bad for the environment. If you by chance still find yourself on the surface, good luck. The ground in the areas that were plasma bombed have likely turned to a glass-like substance similar to what's produced by volcanoes. Molten earth that has assimilated everything around it and cooled into large, hot, jagged formations. Any glass planet is effectively rendered uninhabitable, devoid of water and life. Subscribe for more One Minute Halo and be sure to check us out on TikTok.